Hey there everybody, Phil here for AndroidCentral.com and it's time to revisit an old app. Let's see if you can find it here. And it's Bing! So, yes, Bing, the scourge of Android, I understand. Uh, if for some reason you're unaware of Bing, it's actually Microsoft's surf, uh, search service. It's pretty darn good, um, especially considering it started kind of with nothing. Uh, and if you follow Bing, you know, it's now got the whole thing with Yahoo and everything. So anyway, there has long been an Android Bing app. Uh, this was actually preloaded on a bunch of phones, including the Verizon Fascinate was probably the biggest. Uh, it's on the LG Revolution, which is also on Verizon. So Verizon and Bing have had kind of a deal for a little while now. Uh, the app itself just was updated and it you know, it looked pretty good before. Now it just looks even more gorgeous. Uh, one of Bing's big giant features is photography and images and stuff. So you have this beautiful just uh, background image on here. Now the menu used to be down here at the bottom, kind of a tab metaphor thing, and it was really boring. So what they've done now is they brought up a list, which is very Metro-ish. Uh, if you're not aware of Windows Phone 7 at all, that's Microsoft's operating system for mobile, right? And the scheme is called Metro. That's the nickname. So that has now been brought into this app. Uh, so let's just do a quick walkthrough. So you've got a search bar up there with voice search. Cool. And here's your list. Images, maps, local deals, movies, news, shopping directions, weather. If you hit menu, you get some other options, your stuff. You can post. What can we post to? Post to Bing with Facebook. Or Facebook with Bing, I guess. <laughs> Uh, let's see what we have under more, share, add to context, refresh, send feedback and settings. Let's see what the settings are. Again, still more of the Metro look and feel. Cool. Safe search, you can turn that off, that's nice. I, you know, look for porn data. No, I just don't like people messing with my search options. If I see something I don't want to see, I'd rather be the one to get upset about it. So let's go through this list now. Images. Image search has always been a really good thing. For some reason it thinks I'm in Pittsburgh, which is fine actually. My wife's from Pittsburgh. Uh, let's try maps. Bing Maps, if you haven't seen it. Uh, you know, it's a decent map service. I prefer Google Maps. Zoom out a little so you can't quite see where my house is. But it, you know, as far as map services go, it's not bad. And Bing has actually, I'm not sure if they have it on the mobile side. Uh, has a really cool 45 degree thing that Google just started doing. So that's maps. What else? Local. So you can look up local restaurants and movie theaters and all that stuff. Again, Google Maps does it, but if you prefer Bing, you have the option. Deals. So best local deals, kind of a Groupon-y type thing, right? Uh, movies, you can look up movies. I think we all know how to do that. Let's see what we get with news. Now if it's going to try to do news locally, yeah, see we've got local news, let's see what happens there. Um, so interesting, Firefox for Android is the top news under all, huh? Let's see, can we swipe left and right? No, that's lame. Why can you not swipe? That's ridiculous. You can't, however, hit the arrow, right? I want to see local news because it usually laps me in with Miami. I couldn't be farther away. Hey, Pensacola News Journal, good job. Where I used to work. Um, let's see what else we get. News, shopping, and weather. Let's see the weather. All right, that's not horrible. They're using AccuWeather. You can get five-day forecast next week or hourly. Okay, cool. So that's it. That's the new Bing for Android. Um, you know, am I going to use it? Maybe not. But if you're into Bing, and I know a lot of you are, the app has gotten even more pretty. It's it's just a pretty, pretty app. That's the only way I'll explain it. It's called Metro, sort of, almost like Windows Phone 7, and it's on Android. So we'll see you later.